everyone, everybody. Today I'm going to show you how to create a playlist on your iPod Touch or your iPod Nano. Now instead of using iTunes, I'm going to use the Copy Trans Control Manager, which is free. You can see it right here in the window. Um, the reason I'm using Copy Trans instead of using iTunes is that iTunes has been locking up on me a lot. And if you use Windows instead of a Mac, you can pretty much expect iTunes to lock up at you in some point. So instead of using that, I'm going to use this Copy Trans Manager, like I said. I'm going to just pull this up. And you can see I already have my iPod Touch in the in the pane here. You can see this is the name of my iPod on the left and these are some playlists that I already have created. Now when you have the iPod selected in this pane you'll see all the songs and all the videos that you have on the iPod regardless of what playlist they're in. So to create a new playlist you just come over here and either and you can right click add playlist and then you can give it a name like nighttime if you want to. So it's empty right now. But you can go into your iPod and you can take one of these tracks and drag and drop them into the playlist. And you can see that it shows up in the playlist here if you click on the playlist. Now, if you want to add songs from your hard drive, you can come up to this button right here. It says Add Tracks to Playlist. And it'll pop up here. You can select through a lot of these. I'm just going to click one, Open. And you can see it opened here. Now it will also, even though you opened it in the nighttime playlist, it'll also appear in the iPod. It's in alphabetical order. And if you want to update the iPod, it's the same thing as syncing in iTunes. It's just called Update here. So just click Update. And you can see in this little bar right here, it updated really quickly. And you can eject it as soon as you're done. So I'm going to eject it. And it's that easy. You don't even have to wait for the ejection process like you do in iTunes. You know iTunes likes to close out and sync and back up and all that good stuff. But with Copy Trans Manager, you don't have to sit there and wait. So that's the good part about that. Thanks for watching.